Hey y'all, welcome back. We are going to be doing episode 3 of The Walking Dead Season 1. So let's dive right on into it. I know there's enough waiting for the stream, so we'll play this. Play. Alright, so we are on the long road ahead. Damn. So, uh, I have played uh, the first season and the second season. Um... But that was years ago when this game first came out, so I don't remember everything. I remember, like, the big kind of chunks. Um, like, I remember a little bit about Larry, but I didn't remember some of the stuff that led up to it. Uh, the first um, episode, I do remember a little bit. Like, I remember Herschel's Farm. Um, and I knew, like, Sean died. But other than that, that's all I kind of remembered. Um, so I remember, like, bits and pieces of, like, the big, the big scenarios, but I don't remember, like, stuff that leads up to it. So, please no spoilers in chat, um, and we will get started with episode 3, Long Road Ahead. Alright, everything seems to be going good. Yep, everything's fine on my end. Let's get her going. Generate story decisions for skipped episodes. What? No? Did it not register that I did episode two? That would be bad. Is there a way I can go back? Yeah, let's go back. Or maybe it clicked no. I wonder if the file got corrupted or something because there was a time where it was like the big, um, the, like I said, no spoilers, there was the Larry decision. And um, for some reason it like, I was talking to Clementine and Ken at the same time, Previously, so it was like freaking out. So let's see how dead. it remembers. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! Kenny! What the fuck?! Sounds like a car. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their okay, eyes. Okay, so on did, that, it didn't remembered. As long as they oh, can get I, oh, you know what? Them. I wonder if it is picking up on the 400 days, um, kind of like, I would say like DLC. It was more like, um, like a spinoff with, um, oh, the, the character that starts with an M from the TV show. She has a machete. Um, I was Michonne, but I could be wrong. I haven't seen The Walking Dead in years, like since high school. So like, it's been a while since I've seen The Walking Dead. But that might have taken place between the episodes. Um, I know that came out after season one, so that might be registering. Um, but that's my best guess. Either way, we're going to continue. It looks like it's saved. Um, we're going to continue with episode three. Uh, it looks like all this decision saved, which, I, which sucks because some of it I wanted to alter, but it's all right. This game series adapts to the choices you make. It's, the game will be tailored on how we play. Uh, my first playthrough, I think I did help Kenny, but this one, I guess I stayed silent. Like, I didn't choose. So, both both sides were like, what the fuck, you could have done something, and I didn't do anything, which is fine. It is what it is. There's worse things, but we move on. It looks like we're back in Macon. Episode 3, Long Road Ahead. Looks like this is our lucky day. Yep, back in Macon. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. Fair. I said, Mears, the shell, uh, the cell shading, really dark for this episode. Wow, Kenny looks pissed. So I'm gonna try to make up um, a little bit of ground with Kenny because I didn't have his back in the freezer. Oh, man. Oh, that's right, he got shot. You made up your mind yet? About what? 
When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. No, eventually the, the place will run its course. We should go. The motel's run its course. And it's not Instant mood change. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. That's, that's fine. Oh shit, the drugstore. A uh, helicopter landed in it. The military's definitely gone through okay, this. Just like since last, last uh, over the rig into the pharmacy and scrape together whatever supplies are left. It sounds like they've done this a couple times though. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Sounds like they've been through this a couple times. Shit. Wait, you, you okay? Go. The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Alright, um... We'll take a look. But yeah, I agree with Kenny that, like, the motel is fine. It was a good temporary thing, but you've been there for three months. Time to pack up and go somewhere else. If you, if you tapped out this town, you gotta go. So much for the military. Yeah, that's why the military just didn't wasn't able to do anything. Huh? Alright, so that's busted as hell. Let's grab I wonder if we can Oh that those tires ain't going anywhere. Huh. Huh. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Thanks, Lee. Yeah, those ti those flat tires, I don't think he's gonna be able to push it. Yeah, that Jeep ain't going nowhere. But it's nice though that it's got a winch, so we might be able to to use the winch. Hell yeah, let's go. Those fuckers are heavy, especially in military grade. And then she'll be fine. If you say so, you're the only one she seems to give a damn about anymore. Well, you and Clem. I don't have anything against Lily. Just Larry was a dick. I don't have anything against her. I know she lost her dad, but we gotta move on. Alright, let's get that winch going. Oh, it's convenient it's on the outside. Usually it's on like the da like by by the dash where the like the windows and stuff. Well, the G might not have a power window, might have the main current station wagon. Smart. Hope so. Not like we had much choice. Right. It's a powerful winch to drag that jeep. Solid. All right. Top Doug on was up. asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? Sean? I wasn't sure it phased him. Yeah. Of course it did. What would he say? He wanted to know if Herschel's son somehow made it. Pretty sure he knows he didn't. Don't worry, you made out like a hero in his eyes. It's not like that. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Thanks, Ken. Uh, oh, shit! Thanks, man. Nice one. I'll ask him if he's okay. I'll ask him he's okay. Are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. No, get ah! off here. No! Oh, Dick, I'm shot. Go go! Why is she help screaming? me? Ah! Somebody help me! Oh god! Oh god! What the, what the hell is that? A walker? No. Walkers don't scream, do they? Ah! Jesus, I don't think so. Get us killed! No shit. And actually. Oh, she's done. She's already been bit. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, he's her as bait. We leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Yeah. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes.
I'm gonna leave her. I'm gonna leave her. I think that's a good call. She's already gone. Like, she's already gonna turn. Like, I didn't want to shoot, um... The one at the motel originally. I didn't want to shoot her. I don't want to shoot... Like, this will help us out. She's already gone. Yeah, it's a little morally... Sketchy, I guess, but... Ken Kenny's got a good point. I do think that that's the right call. But help us out. Let's, let's get supplies and get the hell out of Dodge here. God, she's going nuts. We should oh, be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. No oh, shit. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. All right. Oh, dude, I'm grabbing everything. Anything else? Oh, I grab that. Oh shit, there's a bunch of stuff on this side too. Alright. She's gone. There's not much time now. Okay, the Why'd you interrupt me? Bandage is good. On the ground here. Maybe this way. Is there anything else? Right Open up this. Hell yeah, let's go. We're Ransacking the place. I mean, this technically was Lee's uh, folks' place. Girl didn't die for nothing. Yeah, Up we got a lot of stuff. We still had a bunch of time to spare too. Up and over. Here still we go. Clear. Let's hustle. Oh, shit. Kenny. Hey, bud. No, oh, I guess I'll get it myself. Bridge. Out. Let's fucking get out. I agree. Pilot's gone. There he is. There you go. Don't waste the ammo. Just butt stock. There you go. I'm more out of do it. Sorry, bud. He's got a sick helmet, though. What the fuck was that? They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? Thanks, Kenny. So I wonder if Kenny's upset because I didn't have his back. And, uh... I bet Lily is, like, happy with me right now, but... Am I hella dark or this? Maybe I'll just play. There we go. Get the light going a bit. Wow, looks like the bandits really uh not like the motorhome. Why are we still here? If the bandits know we're here. We should get the hell out of Dodge. It's not the best place to fortify. Dude, Kenny looks pissed all the time. Oh, Clementine. You're back. She talked to me. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my oh, wall. Oh, she wouldn't even put them on. Hey, sweet pea. Nice. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? Might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Wow. Okay. So, what did you get? It'll be all right. You're fine. A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. That's fair. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take I, a look at the wall, Lily. Yeah. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. 
And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. We're strongest wow. together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this Fair. not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, it comes. Really. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people. We'll do it as Not we, just as, things. As it comes. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. Mm -hmm. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? I'd like to. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. Well, this place isn't super, super safe. This is important. Not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Kenny, I thought it was Some your pal. Girl came screaming out of an alley. Kenny's she pissed at me. Dead, hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what she is was happening? gonna die. She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't Probably savable. It's, it's not what? a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. Yeah. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's oh. right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. All right, Lily's uh, come a little loose. She'll get over it. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. No. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! We both went out and got supplies. It's fine. We'll be alright. She just lost her dad. Like, yeah, what's going on? Coming to a head. Yep. You could say that. What's up, Carly? Well, I think you did good today. Thanks. And I find myself thinking that most days. Shucks. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Okay. Sounds good. I like Carly. She's a good person. She seems to dig Lee, which is it's great. I, I like Kenny. The one like, glitch in the game decided... It's going to be tough to be pals with him, apparently. I'm not thrilled with Lily just because she's not the greatest person. I understand she's trying to do what's best for the group. Everybody is. But there's different ways to go I'm around sorry. it. sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Neither. I wanted to follow up just with straight what up. about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. Mm -hmm. For real. Oh, for real. You got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. Whoa. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not yeah. stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? <laughs> I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Why would you just toss in the garbage? It's not like I come pick it up. Okay, 
I'll poke around a little bit. All right. Thank you. Dumb. A mystery. Speaking of which. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. <laughs> can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson. You're you, you Robin? <laughs> That's Robin. I know who it is. <laughs> uh, sure. Yeah, you'll be Robin. That's fine. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. It's more like Damien. It's more like what Damien Wade. He's not Dick Grayson. I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. <laughs> I know Celltale also did uh, the Batman series, which uh, I do plan on playing um, after The Walking Dead, as just because there's like four, well, four and a half seasons of The Walking Dead, um, so we have a lot of way to go. But I do want to play the Batman series again. I played it a little bit on my channel like years ago, hey, but Clementine. it'd be fun to go through it again. Really? What's up, Clone Jane? What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. That's fair. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. What a dick. What? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> I'll talk to you later, Clem. Well done. Okay. <laughs> well done. Okay. So Clem's doing fine. Uh, I'll talk to Kenny. What's up, dude? Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all Sorry. carry guns now, and I don't like it. Well, it's the way it's, it's got protection. Be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? I'm fine. Harder with Lily, guys. Just... Yeah. You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. That's fair. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. Yeah, sit together as a group. Uh... Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Nope. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Just gonna leave glass around? About the guns. Don't you start. What? I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. Yep. There's no doubt about that. I'll talk to you later. What? All right, let's go talk to Carly. See what she has to say, and then we'll check out the glass. No, I think, especially in a zombie apocalypse, you need firearms. Not to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment, too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Oh. Uh... What about okay. It? You're a convicted killer. Okay. Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. Oh, thanks. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. That's fair. Uh, 
That was forever ago, I guess, but you're probably disagree. Right. Of course, I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. You have been with them for like over so three months. Then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Thanks. Oh, all right. We got the smooches. Me later. Let's go. She laid one on him. Let's go. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Um. I'll ask about the flashlight first. Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's no broken. Shit. And the batteries might be in backwards. <laughs> I love this is a it running. It just one. Everything into. should. What was the question? <laughs> Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. <laughs> All right. I believe you. Uh, do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor in a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know. This place what? is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right That's now, it doesn't fair. seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. Okay. I'm, I'm not bringing up Lily. Good idea. Alright. I'll talk to Clementine first. Always Clementine. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. Yep. The car I was in was a police car. And I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't you think any questions? so. You can uh, go on back to your things. All right, come to understand what you did. All right, well that's good. All right, Kenny. Right, guys. I'll talk to Kenny about it. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah. What do you got? This may or may not go well. It's serious. Okay. Should I sit down? Come on. I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. Wasn't for touching kids, was it? <laughs> no. No, 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 that's, that's, that's fucked up. Here. I no killed shit. a guy in a fight. Should I be worried there's anything else in your past that's gonna come out? No. No. Good. But you should know, if we gotta make numbers when it comes to a boat, this is gonna matter. Thanks. Well, at least I told him, I guess. Should I even tell Katja? No, I... I'll just leave it with... I'll just leave it with Kenny. I don't, hey, I don't think I'll talk to Katja. What's up, Lee? What's up, Ben? Uh, he doesn't need to know right now. Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Nikon. Oh. <laughs> I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. Instant it's super change. nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. <laughs> Is... Then you're an idiot. A flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Oh, really? Okay then. Talk to you later. I don't want to talk about Lily. Bye. All right, let's go check out the glass. There's some broken glass on the ground there. Probably to the flashlight. Yep. Uh, 
Well. Duck. <laughs> Clue. Maybe. Oh, music change. I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It's an X. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. I wonder if Clementine's got any pink chalk. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst. Lee. <laughs> My God. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Okay. Really? Totally. I was coming to see him for clues and... Yeah, Duck, I got it. Good job. <laughs> this part's great. He wants a high five. Yeah, I'm not going to leave a man hanging. There you go, bud. Cool. Thinks you're incredibly awesome. Let's go. Uh, I'll talk to Duck about the flashlight. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. Probably for neither. a good thing. That's probably, the probably for the best. Yep. Have you found anything else? Just the chalk. I also found some bugs underneath the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. Okay, I won't. <laughs> You seem to know a bit about all of this. The chalk? You found the scuff here? This is gonna sound crazy, but you're not involved, are you? No, I'm a good guy. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. I'll inspect the chalk. <clears throat> Somebody was over here, too. See? I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck, you did. Well done. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Go look around. Those bandits gave us help, but they've been quiet for days now. That means I'll probably come back soon. God, this place does not look great. Oh. <clears throat> oh. That's not good. Is it a delivery for us, or we... It's the supplies. Son of a bitch. So someone's been leaving it out there for some... It's probably like... Somebody else, maybe their friend. Could be a deal with the bandits. Uh, yeah, whatever it is, it's not great. Someone's been leaving supplies out. I'm guessing either. You haven't come up with anything, have you? Katya or came ben. up with this. It's got Kenny a bunch of meds it. in it. Lily it was in a grate it. on the outside wall. The kids. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. Is it though? What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Y'all better get your right ass there. out here! Wow, that happened quick. Fucking around. What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall him. What? Just keep him talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life! Great shit. Enough of this bullshit! Oh, yeah. Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors! Yeah! Hold it, asshole! Take it easy.
Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone! Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we gotta! That's why! Not great reasoning. We can split the supplies, spread them around. Or we could just kill you and take it all! And, and, and what about when they run out? When you don't have us out there collecting them for you? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up, bro! Christ! Oh, shit! Time to go. <gasps> Let's go, Carly! Only fucking two bullets? Ooh, right in the ass. Oh, great. Get back there! Smoke him out! We gotta get out of here! Go, no shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! That was delayed. Oh my god, the delay on this is pretty rough. There we go. Go. Now, get over here, hurry! Right, probably check on the right side. Get inside! Gotta go there. The RV's having a hard time starting. Help! On the right side. Oh, the kids, both That's of them? Jesus. On. Mikasi doesn't like guns. Oh, that dude's fucked! Where Sorry, buddy. Another one. Go. Gotcha. Hurry, Here come go. on! Clementine stay. We got it. It's gonna be okay. Oh shit. Oh Christ. I got him, I got him. Stuck good. Anyone bit? Let me get in the RV! Screw her! Let her stay! Shit! Not starting. That's great. This is a sick part of the game, I'm not gonna lie. Suddenly first person shooter. Let's go! We got her going. Time to go. Last chance, get down here! Well, we ended up being in the camper anyway. Yeah, the motel was not that safe. You're kind of like, like Colga in. Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm they fine. Don't look oh, great. Shit. oh shit! Oh shit! I'm sorry. Everything's fine. Ben. Everything's not fine. We need to figure out I'm how. I'm sorry. It's happened. definitely Ben. We just lost everything. Well, we're lucky as shit to have this RV. And nobody died. Agreed. Cat's head is split open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. I'll turn this thing around. Of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? Please, I we have to get it out of you then. Back off. You are in no position to make demands. Whoa, Neither whoa, whoa, you. you're just pointing fingers. I didn't just come up with this. I've had my suspicions. Holly's trustworthy. She's got a traitor, Lily. Yeah. Thank you, Lee. She can fight her own battles. Unless there's something going on here that implicates you both. Don't be ridiculous. Are you serious? Like, look, maybe we should vote or something like that. Vote? Vote? <laughs> what? Just look. Carly's a stand-up gal, and maybe this was all just a let mistake. We need to look at the facts. Just let it go. Calm we'll down. On. We'll eat, and we'll deal with it. Let's just let it go. People make mistakes, and yeah, this is a fucking doozy. But it's not worth it, Lily. Then it's what not. do we not forgive? Honestly, tell me. Kenny can kill my dad. Carly can steal from us. I don't Where's think the line? Nobody was stealing anything. Was it both of you? What? I've seen you two together. Was it both of you? Look, just let me out. 
I think it's Ben. It, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. Lily, lay off of him. I... <laughs> Shit! What's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. All right, well, we can deal with this now, then. Okay. Kitty, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. It should be. Really? Out. She's really adamant about this. Like, is there a point in putting your hazards on in a zombie apocalypse? Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. <laughs> Everyone keep your eyes peeled. God damn it. You know what? We shouldn't just Fucking kick you out. We should hear half. what everybody thinks. I think there you should go. chill out. I'm not gonna take this. You can push Ben really around, but you can't push me else. around. I'm really sorry you feel that way. I'm starting it was ben. to think maybe it was both of you. There's no way it was Carly. It was somebody else. It could have even been someone sneaking into our camp. That's ridiculous. That's Is what it? you think? Yes. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote I'm counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. You don't want to brought this up? Trust me, I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Huh, the hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. Just you think any of that is just, good now? Just stop. Just stop. stop. Panicking. Seriously, Ben. You need to stop and just take a breath. Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this. Shut yeah. up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. He's dealing with a walker. Let him be. You have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you. Stop this. You're torturing him. No. Ben, stop. Ah, this is about trust, and I've shit. never trusted you. I did it. What? Yeah, it was me. That gets you to lay off the kid? I think you're capable of being a real piece of shit. Wow. No, it wasn't you. Not with her in your life. Thank you, Clementine. I got it. Please, let's just get back That's in the That's not RV. happening. You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can hurt you. But you're just a scared little girl. Get the fuck over it. Take Fair. a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. Fair. Thank you, Kenny. Now, what the fuck's the problem? Yo! Yo! That was uncalled for. Drop it. Uncalled for. Holy fuck. Kenny, what's happening? Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Don't worry about Clementine right there. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I uh. Please. I think we, I, yeah, we'll leave her. What are we gonna do with her? We're, we're leaving her. She's, uh... I'm not coming with us. She's a problem to the group. I'll easily. die out here. I don't care. Yeah. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. I don't care what he did before. You know? Yeah, he told me. I don't give a shit. If we keep you we with go. us, how long until you get me? I was trying to protect all of us. By shooting Carly? I don't have anything left. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. Thanks, Ken. Sorry. That's on you. you. There's no way you needed to shoot Carly. Ben, get the fuck in. I'm sorry. There's no reason why you needed to shoot her. Yeah, we're gone. Sorry. You will make it on your own. She's got a gun. Oh, uh, well, we said drop it. I'm sure she picked it up. Lee, a word, please? Okay. R.I.P. Carly. She was a great shot, too. Like, she helped out the group so much. Like, she came back for us when we were at uh, St. John's Farm. 
Why shoot her? Oh my god, that's so dumb. What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? Probably not. Oh! What the fuck? He's been bit. Happened during the raid. <sighs> What's the plan? You've never had a bite victim in the group before. He's the, yeah, he's the first. I I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys, what keep else the status, is there to do? I guess. We thought you should know. I appreciate it. Important to stay honest with each other. Anyway, made up with Ken. I appreciate that. We would appreciate it. Turn the Brooklyn hoodie. This is a rough episode. Doug is bit. Straight up. I love it. Straight honest. Bit by He's bit. Trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What I about Carly? Gone. Yeah. I won't come back. Because she was shot in the head. That's right. It's horrible. It is yeah, horrible. It is. God damn. I, you know what? I need a minute. I'm glad I have you. Oh, yep. Well, Me just too. Get some I bear 30 going. I my tree house that day. And thought about dropping a hammer on your head. Oh, gee, thanks. <laughs> That's nice. What? Why? In case you were up to no good. Okay, Before some, you, there some was some bare thirties in the chat. He was yelling and trying to get into my house. He wanted to take the TV and tried to break the glass door with a rock. Then some walkers came and scared him away. It's a TV. The door was open. He was dumb. <laughs> he was dumb. Fair enough. <sighs> Fell asleep. Whoa! What happened? Sweet stick! Get off of me! All right, a little nightmare fuel. We got something up ahead. That there was no transition. Like I didn't even know Lee fell asleep. Just straight up. Damn. Damn it. Roads blocked. Oh, we, we could probably move stuff out of the way. Now we got to deal with this. We take everything. By what the status is, we'll, we'll deal with it when the time comes. No biggie. Oh, um, we can't move that. That one is something we can't move. Well. Is guess, there any way to get around it? Yeah, I guess we gotta Doesn't go around. Look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. We gonna rock a boxcar? We gonna be train people? I guess it's you and I go look around. Yeah, yeah let's, let's do yeah, that. Yeah, everyone else relax. Claire, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car, you mean like bear, bear thirty? Dehydrated. It's a freighter, huh? Be careful in there. Oh, well, gonna be a you dining think there car. might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. Whoo, dripping in sarcasm. All right. Um. Let's start with the uh, bar scar. Mm -hmm. 
So somebody's been living out of this. Okay. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yep. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Oh, a map. Yeah, let's snag that. I don't think they're gonna need it. The map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Hey! 27, Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. That's good. Oh, got some water. Grab that for Doug. To catch you, for Doug. So got some tools. Spanner, monkey wrench, spike remover. Uh, I think the adjustable wrench might be best. Let's snag that. Yeah, you know, we could probably take this too. Oh, can we not? Oh, all right. So you can only take one. Alright, so you only take one. Well, I'm taking the adjustable one. I feel like that will be the best. Let's snag that. We'll keep that. I thought you could pocket all of this, but I guess that makes sense. Alright. So this has got the tools in it. The other one's got, like, the engine to prime it. What about this? Nothing. Just the engine. Okay. about this also nothing all right well I guess that's that shit what's up man we got one Walker Sitting in the chair. We got him. No, he's, no need to use the uh, the gun. <sighs> Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> that, that seems protocol. He probably got I killed don't on the think window. This guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it. <laughs> Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. <sighs> Kenny's alive. Just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. Hold on, this fucker works. Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This horse will take us right to Savannah. This house. Hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. Um. I wouldn't yeah. mind plowing through some walkers. That's the spirit. Try to get this thing started. There's got to be some sort of manual or something. <laughs> I don't know about that. Man, hey, if ben. you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Pen seems so defeated. Man, this could be exactly what we need. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. No. 
Not gonna say anything about it, huh? Oh. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. Of course. I can kinda see the indentations from the writing. Oh, we're gonna do the um the rubbing that uh that, that Clementine was doing. Alright, um I don't think we need a pencil. I bet there's a pencil in the RV. I guess I have to go down this way. I can't take the ladder. There's probably a pencil in the RV. Uh, can I not go this way? Oh, I can go around. Looks like it'll get that pin out. I don't think we want to do that quite yet, do we? Derailed. Oh, maybe. We'll come back. I can get it over there. Uh, thanks, man. So we're gonna have to go up and around. I bet we had to go out where Ben was. Where he dragged that body. The body of the conductor. Jesus! Oh. There's the conductor, so that's... A car must have smashed into this. Or at least they have their seatbelt on. Okay, so open up the door. This door's gonna hurt. Oh, okay. Animal crackers! All right! Uh... Well, kill him first. All right, I understand what we gotta do. Then. You aren't gonna like this. That'll work too, I guess. Excuse me, I'd like to get the animal crackers. Hell yeah! Anything in the back seat? Anything else? Look at the door. Okay. Well, we dealt with that. Can we go around? We can. Okay, cool. Just a zombie. Just chilling. And see, we can go up the ladder, but we can't go down the ladder. That makes sense. To a Clementine Stone. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? Mm -hmm. No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? I'm gonna do a rubbing. There to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. She's adorable. Alright, so it's in the RV. Oh, wait, we should give that water to Duck. Oh, we found animal crackers, too, yeah. I found these, if Duck's up for it. Thank you, that's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not duck, huh? No. The most okay. trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. <laughs> Animal! Thank you, Lee. Sure. I got water, too. Hold on. There you go. Here. Found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It, it does. I know. But there's bees well, out here. I don't, but you're probably right. Ben, how you we doing? Found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Ben, you're fucking useless, man. Back in the RV. That's the door. Oh, right there. Yep, right in the, the little the 
the holder. The cup holder. Perfect. Not a bad RV. A little old, but she works obviously, so that's good. Alright, so we'll go up the the ladder, which apparently we can't go down it. Let's try this notepad. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting oh. the engine. Whoops. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. That's so I got the pencil. There you go. Perfect. Damn, that was quick. Read it now? Yeah, should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. What steps start with six? Okay, down, down, up, 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 down, up. Uh, okay. I guess we're starting with six. So it's... Oh, wait, we can look at it. Sweet, awesome. So down, down, up, 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 down, up. Okay. Down, down, up. 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 Down, up. Son Let's of a go. bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up. Dude, it's fucking so lit in here. Let's go. All right, so five. Uh, to the left and down. Okay, so we got this needs to go. Oops. Left and down. Now we're okay, talking. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. And the other one said it was not. Oh, I bet it's the primer switch. The engine. Okay. That was the first uh, engine compartment. All right. Nine. Why did they put it in two? Why didn't they put it next to each other like they did for five? Okay, so left, then right. So, left. Low oil. That's not great. But I think oh, she'll still run. Right. Who knew? Hey. Holy shit! We're golden. Now we know how to start an engine, guys. Yeah, we are golden. Man, it feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. I agree. Mom, let's see if she'll move. Don't want to talk about Duck right now. He's not doing great. Oh, you, see, you can go down the ladder. Oh, he said, let's see if she'll move. Meaning the... Got it. Yeah, I don't really want to talk about Duck right now in front of Kenny, just because he seems a little, obviously, irritated with the whole situation, but... Focus on this right now. We are literally trapped. Like the situation is not much better than it was from a motel. It's so, all yours. All right, let's give it a go. Damn it! Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? I know exactly where. We're unstuck. Yeah, I yeah. got it. I know exactly where to go. Go through the box, huh? This way. It's a good thing I went this way before we got this uh, the train going. All right, so we pull this out first. Shit, broken. All right, it's broken anyway. Uh, let's try pulling it. There's gonna be a better way to do this. Oh, we got that monkey ranch. Pretty decent food fighter song. There it is. There. Easy. Hey, easy. Kenny, we're loose. No shot. He heard us. No shot. There is an engine that is primed, and he is way the fuck up there. I don't think so. You touch any of my stuff? Oh shit! Uh, saw dude.
we'll be honest, be honest. Yes. Yeah. That's fine, you can have that. Really? Yeah. I got them all right up here. The old brain, got them all memorized. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. What's up, Chuck? Charles, if you fancy. Lee. What's up, Chuck? That you grew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. <laughs> Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. <clears throat> I don't know if scaring people in a zombie apocalypse is the greatest idea. If their reaction is to just immediately shoot, it might not be great. You met Chuck? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy. Ben too. <laughs> Fucking Ben. <laughs> I wouldn't say train folk are particularly normal. I said well. Thank okay. nice. like, you. Yeah. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. Oh, I thought, I thought he was turning already. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit yeah, as a fiddle in be no fine. time. He'll just, you know, fit. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. I appreciate it. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. All right, so we lost Carly because of Lily. We ditched Lily. Now we gained Chuck. Oh, he's got a guitar. Play fucking Wonderwall. Actually, don't. Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Fair enough. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Yeah. Fine, then. All right. Uh, I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. Aw. Yeah, get some... You caught us on a bad day. Yeah. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. Hmm. Joe Glenn. That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Play, uh... Orange Blossom Special by Johnny Cash. It's about trains. He should know it. So that's it? We're cut loose? We're set. Ready Seems to go. that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Well, Chuck's already set and ready to go. Want to ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. <laughs> I find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. That works. Duck's sick. Get on yeah. the train, Clementine. Oh, all right. No need to be upset with her. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, we can't ignore we this can't anymore. This. Yeah, we gotta. Look at the kid, kid. Yeah. This is happening. Ain't shit happening. And if it were, what can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through. Get on, Cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. All right. Candy's in denial. But I understand. Away we go. Yeah, it's not doing too bad. Rough scene. 
Oh, that car got fucked. It's an interesting episode. Shit kicked off real quick, whereas like episode two it had like a gradual build, and uh, this one, right at the gate. Now, now we're on a train. What's up, Stubby? Doing all right, clown. She's looking at. Got to be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> uh, there were four of us. Dad, get them. Nope. No. Ah, living got them. Lee, Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. I got you. He does not look great. I'm being honest. Could you just get that off his face, please? Okay, yeah. Oof. He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. We just just got it started. All right. You know, a train's probably pretty decent uh, for a zombie apocalypse, though. Probably pretty cold in the winter. What's up, Ken? You need to stop the train. All right, or ignore me. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. They'll be fine. This is rough. Uh, he won't be. He's going, Kenny. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Yeah, Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. I don't know about that, bud. In denial. This isn't about Doug. It's not about my son dying. What the hell do you know? You're not my friend. I don't hate you. You sure as shit haven't done anything for me. Wow. You think you're the reason Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? Do you ever stop thinking about yourself? You need to just get over it. Fuck, man. There's no room anymore for feeling bad about things. Bad shit's gonna happen for the for the rest of our lives. It's just the way it yeah. is. So stop the goddamn train. Got it. I thought we were friends. I thought we were pals, Ken, but I guess not. I understand this is really tough, dude. Yeah. And it's... I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. What do you mean? Just want to be okay. I... Gotcha. It's time to... This is not possible. Oh, we gotta put him down. What are we gonna do? Yeah, uh, this we is can't not allow great. him to become one of those things. But what if, what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But no. There's. 
Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Yeah. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. In the head. Yep. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't I'll step have up. to. I'll step up. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. That yeah, no. No parent should watch their, we their can say our son or daughter. Just let that be it. I don't know. Die before them. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. I'm here to help. Why don't we take him into the forest? Yeah. So Clementine doesn't have to see. Yeah, totally get it. I'd rather I'd rather go out in the Give forest. A peaceful. To say goodbye. Yeah, of course. We'll, we'll hang we'll hang in there. Yeah, he's not doing that. Just chopping Ben. I'm sorry, Clem. You lost a friend. Farkin Brewing Company. All right. Cheers to that. What's happening? It's, it's a very, very sad situation. Duck is dying. Just be honest. I know. What are you doing? I'm putting him out of his God. Oh. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are. What the? No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. Uh, did he turn and hit bit Katya? What happened? That was definitely a Kenny scream. Back in the forest we go. They went a really long way. Oh no, she offed herself. Get, get, I gotcha. forgot about this. Oh my god. And he's still, yeah. Why, cat? Honey, oh fucking god! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Duck is not looking great. That's that's just dickish. What the hell happened? You, you can see what happened. Just yeah. Oh my god. Wow. I. I. I am so sorry, Kenny. I am so sorry. Not good trigger discipline, but that's okay. Oh man. That's a hell of a shot. What do we do? Well. Yeah, just let me do it. Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. You shouldn't have to kill your own kid in a zombie apocalypse. Sorry, Duck. You were my Batman to my Robin. Or, you were my. Oh, the way around. Sorry. Looks like you'll never be Batman. You were my Robin to my Batman. I'm sorry, buddy. That's oh, Kenny. Yeah, I wouldn't. I would never want to see my kid with a bullet hole in them when they're sick and turning into a zombie. I'm so sorry, buddy. I know you say we're not pals, but I'm here for you, dude. God. Wow. Okay. Wow. Oh. Um. Oh. 
Okay. You want to talk? Uh-uh. You uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think is going to happen? What Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did? What? I swear. Sorry. I'm going to talk some sense into it. Don't be mad. All right, Chuck. The fuck, man. Hey, how you doing? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. It's not my girl's girl. She time. is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, <clears throat> and then what? We find a boat. Uh, that's the plan. That's, that's a beginning. new idea. You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. Like a gun. Are you kidding me? What? She's too young to handle one? There ain't too young. Not anymore. Yeah, not You me. gotta consider her a living person. Not in the world we That's live in it. now. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. Yeah. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, that, that's fair. A haircut and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. It's a good start. I'm just Be safe yeah. Up here. You betcha. Okay. Dang. Hey. Console Kenny hey. a little bit. It'll be good to get to the water. Yeah. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. That's I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. It's probably a good call. Hey, that, that to me looks like a map. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kenny? Can you just leave me alone? I understand. Hey. Yeah? Hey, Amen. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. That's fair. Still wanna get a boat? It's still the best plan. Okay. All right. It's the best plan. Alright. Well, we can't get by him. Uh, let's go talk to Clementine then. Cut her hair and teach her to shoot. What's up, Ben? Hey, Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Uh, we're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Right? Yeah. Guess not. Charlie didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Oh, yeah, maybe. I don't think so. See ya. Yeah. Wow! 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 Just, uh... Yeah, maybe. The door to the boxcar. Later. Okay. Bottle of whiskey. I guess we'll take that. The whiskey. 
What's up, Clem? Hey, did you talk to him? I did. Yep. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. Well, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. Yep. I like that. Good. Good plan. Alright, I know this is really bad timing, guys, but I definitely have to go to the bathroom. So I'll give you a shot of Lee and Clem. Um, and we'll sit here. I'll, I'll be right back. It'll just be a moment. What an episode so far. Dang. All right, enjoy chair cam.
All right, I am so sorry, guys. Went to the bathroom and my phone started blowing up. What's up, Dan? All right. to know how to protect yourself. Oh. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I need mean, one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's right. just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you... I wouldn't have something. loaded it. Okay. Immediately, but okay. okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. The aim. You look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is Time to teach Clementine how to shoot. Uh, I mean, I try to breathe out before shooting, but this will work too. Make sure you're not breathing too hard. Yeah. And then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, I was a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Decent advice. Okay. Yeah, sorry guys, I had to, went to the bathroom, phone started blowing up, took a couple calls, but we're back. Good, don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You can do it, Clem. Alright, a little low. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I, I know. have to? Sadly, yes. Yeah, you do. To the right. Okay, a little higher. All right, now a little left. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Close. Now keep it steady. There you go. Let's go. I got it. Excellent. Good Nailed shot. it. Yeah, after uh, the day we've had. Sometimes you just need to take a minute, refill your water, got to, you know, got to hydrate to participate, but like, wow, is that rough. Oh, what's up? Welcome to the Bear Den, I love Clementine. How's it going? Alright, so that looked a little to the right, so a little left. More to the left. Just pulling it, I'm going to say a little higher. A little higher. Get a little lower. Steady now. Almost got it. Lower. Nice. Sure. There you go. Nice. Going good. Going good. Uh, hell of an episode so far. Lost. Uh, lost four people out of the group. Kind of going nuts. <laughs> Dang, she na yeah, nailed it. Did. Didn't need any help. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, they are bottles. They are not walkers. But you know how these yeah, we lost work. four. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Yeah, not too bad. Guns aren't that scary. Just, you gotta be a bit ethical with it and gotta know where you're pointing it. Yeah, we lost four. So, Lily ended up killing Carly, and then we left Lily because she really didn't need to do that. And my then and Duck got bit in the motel raid. You'll get used to it. And uh, Katya ended up killing herself because she didn't want to kill or see Duck die. So she took a really easy way out, and Kenny's just going rough. My man went for like, to like you know, in this in this game like 20 minutes ago. He had a son, he had a wife. Next thing you know, both of them gone. Ripped like that. My man is not doing great. Uh, uh yeah, let's look I around because we've got to cut our hair. Few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. God, me too. Alright. So we taught her how to protect herself with a gun, which is huge important for the zombie apocalypse. They look clean enough. Pretty long ass scissors. Those will work. Alright. I'll talk to her and say, hey, I need to cut your hair. Hey, Clint. Hi. So, 
you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Oh, nothing. She's so you adorable. About your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. <laughs> Cause it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Fuck that guy. Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Okay. Mind if we do this now? Yep. I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. Or you can just put it up, but I guess it still doesn't. Do you know how to do this? No. How hard can it be? Not really. I'm going to look like a boy. Shush now. <laughs> She's adorable. So you did time. kill someone before. Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. <sighs> You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Fair. Mm -hmm. right. Nope, that's... You're right. Yep. Before all of this, I was sent to jail, you know? Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? <laughs> all the time. Yeah. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Hair ties? Yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There, all set. She Does looks look so dumb. upset. <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. She wears her hat anyway. Hat gang goes strong. <laughs> okay, bye. Alright, I think now that we have her all set, ready to go, what's their inventory we have? A fucking Ben. Hey, Ben. Hey. See ya. <laughs> How's it going? Hey, what's up? See ya. Alright, fuck. Oh, you know what? We let's give. Yeah, he's not no, doing no, great. Talk to you later, Kenny. Yeah, he's doing rough. Sorry, buddy. We did grab the whis or the uh, fifth of whiskey from Chuck's cab or his car. So we'll, we should probably give it to him. It's his. Here you go, bud. This if you want it. Damn! Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. There you go, man. Want a nip? Yeah. <sighs> Don't see why not. Sure. Ooh. Not known for its finish. <laughs> oh, no fair 30 action. Wonder how long Walking Dead would last with three volatiles from Dynamite spawning. Nobody in there want to share a drink, you let them know. Probably not long. Will do. Like, in this game, definitely not long. In, like, the show, there might be one or two people, but... Yeah, those those things don't fuck around. And you know what? I'm sure Kenny actually would love a drink. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Yeah. Now we can grab the the map. That worked out. All right, uh, now we can go talk to Clement. Damn, you took that like a champ real quick. What's up, Ben? Hey, Ben. Hey. See you. <laughs> Fuck <Yeah>. you. <laughs> so what happened was... Huh? Oh. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? Son of a bitch.
I knew it was Ben. I fucking it's knew all it. It's my fault. Yeah, it is. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend. That he was with them. What? Why would you the believe them? I realized they didn't. It was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still want to talk to me? Yeah. Not really. Not much of a choice. I, I understand. I'm trying not to be too hard on the kid. I'm real sorry. Let's drop it for now, okay? What are you doing out here? I, uh... Couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. You got plenty of it. I was thinking about talking to Kenny. That wouldn't. I guess not. Yeah, I would. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. <laughs> you get why, right? I guess. You better. See ya. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck this guy, apparently. So what happened was Ben, obviously, was giving supplies to bandits. Well, bandits came, they raided the camp because uh, Lee found the stash for showing it to Lily. And they came and uh, there's a big raid. We killed a bunch of people. Hi. Well, I want to Duck ended up getting bit. Me too. Kachi couldn't handle it. We that. lost two people right down in there. Know what to expect. Uh, Lily was blaming Carly. Totally under control. Lily killed Carly. We yes. left Lily, so the group is doing one team, you know. But we gained Chuck though, play. so that's pretty sick. Aside from everyone else, when this Fox Star Hero, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. Let's okay. get a good plan. Right, boat. Well, the plan right now is to find a boat. We need to help find so. a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Okay. But we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. They were. No, look. It's no, been months, though. I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Okay, we'll look for them. Really? Yes. Yeah. How do I say no to Clementine? I'm sorry. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. We're gonna wanna look for a boat here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the savannah to the southwest of us. Now we've got a good chunk of savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think well, about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and... Maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M M something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it. There you go. So we'll it's pretty convenient. There. Yes. You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Uh, I, I would you sure to say no to Clementine? Absolutely not. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. Killing it. I guess we should see how far. Oh shit! Hold on, everybody. Surprised you heard Kenny from in the conductor's seat, but we did. Chuck just standing there like a badass. Just... Alright, let's go see what the fuss is about. Well, shit. That's a problem. Fuck, 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 fuck! Yep, Maybe that's an issue. Walk. That's fucking stupid, Ben. <laughs> I can't Just fuck can't. Ben. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You yeah. gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. 
This ain't shit. This. All right. Yo, you keep screaming like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. More people. Define trouble. Yeah. Anything that gets you killed, or worse, and it tends to come hand in hand with groups of guys in distress. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys wow. got a problem with your train? Yeah. You're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. Sounds good, Kenny. I guess we'll go up to the ladder. Leads up to that wreck tanker. So let's let's, let's take it. If I come up there, Kenny is loud you better well. not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. God damn it. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. What's up, Omid? Krista. What's, What's the up, deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. <laughs> Hey, I'm not gonna bullshit you. Our group <laughs> is a little fucked right now. We had a bite victim, then his mom took her life, and before that, just... It's okay. Yeah. Oh, not shit. having a great day. God damn, you guys have a kid! We had to. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Probably a few Clementine. months. Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. <laughs> this is great. See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? Uh... We'll see what I'll start. They don't need to know when I to jail. The first day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Yeah, he lost his wife. Ben's young and stupid, we just met Chuck. We'll say, yeah, poor Ken. Kenny lost his wife and No, he just shit on Ben more. How long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know. Uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. Pretty fresh. I'm sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. A train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. Oh, we'll shit. help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. Fuck, Krista. I don't care. Through, I guess. If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. All right. Uh, let's take a look at the truck. Anything in here? A couple stop signs, some cones. Uh, yeah, some tape. It looks like. It could be useful. That's about the only useful thing in here. I think cones wouldn't be bad, I guess. I don't really know what the fuck you'd use it for, but stop signs are pretty cool decorations. It's empty. All right, nothing in the generator. Yeah, use the hitch. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Oh okay, yeah, I didn't think so. All right, well, uh, I guess I'll talk to Amid. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh me? What? Amid seems like such a good guy. All right, I guess we're going down. Hey gang, Ben, that why you look so like you're about to square up? Not big on welcomes. Like I said, it's been a bit of a day. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. The plan Plus is one? to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, kid? Ken, it's probably good. for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Oh, he seems so happy. Like, dude, such a breath of fresh air. Alright, so I guess we're going over here. Oh! Right, let's, let's see how the girls are doing. That's it? Okay, I guess we'll talk to Krista. Hey there. That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. Yeah. 
It's a crack shot now. Where are you from? Not sure how. Huh? Where are you from? Yeah. San Small Francisco. Talk. San Fran. A long way from home. I'm Lions play him there. tomorrow in the uh, to NFC Championship. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? <laughs> Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? <laughs> you two will be thick as thieves. <laughs> <laughs> so, Umid likes uh, Southern history. Apparently, he just likes the Civil War. <laughs> And uh, Lee was a, a history teacher in Georgia, so I guess that makes sense. I'm not gonna ask. Oh. Careful, she's a crack shot now. You got this girl shooting guns? Look, I don't need a lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. Yeah. All right. Let him be. I'll head on over to the uh, that station. I like the guitar in the background. Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you Hell said. Hell yeah. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Good enough for me. I'm glad we're looking at every poster that, or every uh, painted art they have on the wall. Somebody was doing some painting. No shit. Somebody was doing a lot of painting. <laughs> Someone's doing some painting. Someone's doing a lot of painting. cares now you should wait for me before trying to open doors sorry uh, luckily it's learn. locked we'll get better at working together I bet we have to look at that window the windows open up there maybe I could look in well, let's at least try it nothing We'll have to find a way in. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? I don't know, I'm a big Sounds fan good. of this plan, but if it's locked and it's the only way in. Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? That's what you see. What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. For real? Let's go, Clem! Clem be damned. Clem came in clutch. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. She's so goddamn adorable. Damn, it's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. Grab a box. Oh, I have to? Oh, I'm not a big fan of this. I don't like using my weapon to, or my melee weapon to do that. That sucks. There's gotta be something useful in here. Locked up good. Of course. 
That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. They didn't have much business back then. I guess not. It's locked. Don't have any keys. Locked up good. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. Oh shit. Okay. Um, anything over here? Nothing. Okay. We looked at it, we tried to open it. It's locked up good, but there's some space at the top. God. You're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. I don't love this idea. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> what a trooper. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. She's scared of something. You. Oh shit. Fuck. Well done. Yeah, we're back. Let's grab the monkey wrench. Oh, all right. Oh, I appreciate you being at the ready there. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. You're good, you're good. I just gotta get those keys. Oh, shit, there's one in there. Fuck. Keys, now! Thankfully, there's only one. We're good. Open it up. Did I not click it? No, oh, RIP. Right, let's try that again. Pretty sure I clicked it, but I might not have registered. That did happen with the... Uh, Kenny and Larry situation. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. Well, not really. There's a zombie in there. Can you imagine if there's more than one key? Keys, now! Thankfully, there's only one key ring, and that entire key shell, and that one key ring only has one key. Like, what would happen if it... Oh, all right. Registered that time. What would happen if, like... God damn. That, that wasn't the key to open so the good. gate. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. That was we're indeed fine. a gunshot. found some walkers. Oh shit. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? Yeah. We handled them. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? Then we wouldn't have handled it. I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. Well, it's a good idea. wasn't great. I hope you know what you're doing with her. Dude, I'm just trying to take it day by day. We're still alive, aren't we? Yeah, you are. Dude, Chris does a piece of work, man. You good, Trump? Sure you okay? Yeah, I'm a little shaky. It'll pass. Oh, we should grab that blowtorch before we leave. Can't go anywhere further. We got it. Well, let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. We learned not to be afraid. They should have got us. 
but we got them. Yeah, seems pretty good. Right. Fear is the thing that will kill us. You understand? Not them now having a spin-off series of the actual Walking Dead uh, TV show of Fear of the Walking Dead. I found a blowtorch in the station. Oh. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Thanks, so mean. So I guess we're gonna take the blowtorch to this. All right, let's talk to Omid for a Think bit. We talked to Krista. Dude, you're cutting metal with fire. How could it not? Fair enough. All right, fuck it. Holes as a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. What? What the fuck you mean by your eyebrows? Something. We have tape. That'll work. Oh, that giant gash into the hose. There's holes. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Thanks, so oh, Thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. So let's try it again. I can't reach it now. Here. The weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no. But I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. Oh! The hell you are! <laughs> I guess he got it. Son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. <laughs> the hell you are. Wow. That's a few of them. One gunshot? Guys! There's something coming! That whole stampede. Thousands. We gotta go! Fuck. Omi! Cut! Cut! I am! Oh, that took out the ladder. Can he go? Oh, yep. Chuck's on there. Oh shit. Shit. Well, what the hell do we do now? Let's keep that. Up. But to God, this works. Holy crap! Let me actually did kick it. Hey, that'll help. We gotta jump! What? No way! Jump on a train. Tail is old this time. <laughs> Come on! Fine. You stay here and we'll go with your lady. <laughs> the hell you will! <laughs> hey, there he goes! Ah! Oh my god. Was I supposed to? Oh. You piece of shit! She's a woman, don't you know? She's fine. Uh, baby, it's okay, honey. I'm okay. Don't give me this. She's a woman, crap. You just busted your leg. I went for the one that was immediately injured. She's got two working legs. That was a lot. Then. Are you hurt? No. Well, okay. Omid is. Speak for yourself. Yeah. I like his spot. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. Looks like that fire really didn't stop him. I was really expecting it to blow, but I guess it didn't. <laughs> I 
Hey, we're almost to Savannah. Aww. Uh, he drew Kenny. Or she drew Kenny. I was gonna say he looks like Kenny, and I went to say she drew Kenny, then it came out as he drew Kenny. I'd never insult Clementine like that. I know she's worried about looking like a boy with her haircut. Kenny, Duck, and Kacha. Damn. It is. Fuck. Duck's not blonde, though. Oh, he might have battled. The Atlantic. Almost there, bud. We have to find a boat. We just have to. We will. What's that? Oh, okay. You'll be all right. I'll be alive. What's that? Yes. Blood in my heart. Oh, great. Blood in my brain, at least. I'll leave you to your thoughts. The cheese is out cold. cold like I've never seen. <laughs> Yo. That fucking thing was broken. What? So did I. Well, what kind of range like is that radio where we're headed? Or walkie-talkie? Oh, the fuck? I don't know, but I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. That's wild. Didn't um, what's it? Glenn have the other radio? He didn't sound like that though. Shit, next time on The Walking Dead. So that was the end of the episode. Kingsway and we're almost at the river. Street. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? We need to focus on finding the boat right now, Claire. Like we talked about on the train. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're going to have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now! Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you! You understand? I will kill you! Wow. Episode 4, around every corner. Well, that was episode 3, guys. Um... Let's see how we did on the choices. Sweet Marcel Dev, did you shoot the girl in the street? You and 60% of players did not shoot. All right, so we're in the majority there. Uh, left behind, did you leave, uh, Did you abandon Lily? You and 45% of players left her. Really? So 55% of people decided, yeah, I know she just killed Carly, but get back into the RV. That's, that's wild. Did you fight Kenny? Uh, you and 45% of players talked him down. Okay, so there was a chance that you'd end up Anger and Kenny, uh, I'm assuming that's when we are talking to him about stopping the train. A heavy burden, did you shoot Duck? You and 81% of players shot him. Well, that's good to know that the Walking Dead community all were like, we'll step up, Kenny shouldn't have to do it. A helping hand, did you help Omid? You and 60% of players helped Omid. Well, yeah, Omid is a super nice guy and he just fucked up his leg. It just makes sense to help him first. But, alright, so we'll we'll take it. It was, what, three out of five? Yeah, three out of five were in the majority. And, like, well in the majority. And the other ones were pretty close, so that's not too bad. Alright, so that was The Walking Dead Long Road Ahead. That was a very interesting episode. But, yeah, we lost four people. We gained Chuck and Omid and Krista, it looks like. At least for the upcoming episode. Um, so lost four, but we gained three. Not bad. Chuck seems like a good dude-ish, I guess. He's a train guy. But not bad. Uh, that episode went a lot quicker than the, the second one. That second one had a lot crammed into it, for sure. 
and it just escalated like crazy. This one was right from the jump. It was like rated, rated, gotta leave, can't uh, stay at the motel. We found a train. Now from the train, we're moving to Savannah, it looks like. Um, so yeah, I guess we'll take it like one step at a time, but that was, that was wild. But I'd like to thank you guys all for watching. I think they'll end today's stream. I'll post this on YouTube like I usually do. Um, and I'm going to get the Twitter or X, whatever it's called, going again. So that way I can at least put it saying that we are live or if the stream will be uh, postponed or canceled or if we're starting early. You never know. Any notifications, I'll do that um, here moving forward. So depending on what the week looks like. I know for sure I'm going to try to stream on Wednesday. Uh, maybe I'll try to stream Monday or something. It might not be Walking Dead. Might be something else with the with the boys maybe or um, maybe a different uh, series will start. I do want to start another series. I do like The Walking Dead a lot, but I also don't want to just get burnt out from The Walking Dead. Maybe offer something else at the same time. It'd be kind of fun. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying it. I know I'm enjoying playing the hell out of this. This is a really, really fun game. Um, and I know this is only the first season and we're already dealing with all these choices, which would be really fun. Um, just to see how everything molds into the final season because it keeps the, the save progress. So I'm excited. I'm excited for the next episode. We'll I'll, uh, definitely be playing the fourth episode sometime next week. And then hopefully by next weekend, we will be on to the final episode of season one. So that should be exciting. Anyway, I hope you guys have a great weekend. I will talk to you guys next stream. Until then, stay safe out there. And I'll see you guys in the next one.